Hey, what's up everyone? This is Anthony from Anthony's Customs, and for this review we're looking at the DC Universe Classics Atom Smasher Collect and Connect figure, build a figure. One of the big guys, although again, kind of like Apache Chief, he's not as big as I would have liked. About nine and a quarter inches tall compared to a standard size figure. Sure, he's bigger. It would have been nice if he was even a little bit bigger, but that's okay. He's still fairly cool. He does have shading throughout the red, he has shading throughout his skin tones, and he has some paintwork for the gauntlets. We see the little rivets and kind of a black wash. Same thing for his boots. And then the line work is, for the most part, straight, and it carries through the ab crunch. There's shading on his face, especially around the eyes. So he's a, he's a pretty nice looking figure. And then the logo on his chest is done nicely. So, again, he's not, kind of, kind of like Apache Chief, he's not... A particularly impressive figure but if you're looking to pick one up there's really no reason not to he's a, he's a pretty good one as far as articulation goes the head doesn't look up or down nearly as much as I would prefer you can get it to go down a little bit but not a whole lot does swivel standard shoulders bicep swivel single hinge elbow wrist swivel like I said the ab crunch works well waist twist is all right this is a separate piece but it's kind of thick so it does get in the way no matter how you do it, so it's a little bit of an issue. His hips do sometimes have an issue. As you can see, they're not quite flush, and that's because they don't fit in properly. So sometimes they pop out too easily, but if you're careful, you shouldn't have too much trouble, and they do have the full range of motion. We have a thigh swivel, a single jointed knee, and an ankle hinge. No ankle rocker on this guy, but this is some pretty cool sculpt work. So again, he's not a great figure, but he's definitely good enough to have if you're trying to round out your collection. Yeah, you might want to pick him up. He's not horrible. I think you can probably get him for a, a little bit cheaper than some of the other more popular figures. So go ahead and pick him up if you are in the market. Don't expect to be impressed, but don't expect to be disappointed. There it is, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can see my upcoming figure reviews, custom figures, and other good stuff. And in the meantime, keep collecting.